Hello, third grade, and welcome to problem solving for today. Quick reminder that you need to be working on your class kit the same time we are doing our lesson, or you can be working on in your workbook and upload the picture afterwards. Let's go ahead and begin. So I am going to draw a rectangle that has a square, sorry, a area of eight square units. And then I want you to draw one that looks different. So here is my example for my square units. This is what they're gonna look like. And you can write this down on yours as well. You'll end up writing two, so make sure you have space. And I'm going to make a vertical looking rectangle. Then I want to make sure it has eight. So I know half of eight is four. So half of it should have four and the other half should also have four. I can double check that my area is eight by counting them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So here's my area of eight. I want you to pause the video and draw a different way to show an area of eight. Now your rectangle would probably look something like this. Turned on its side, you would also have eight square units. So there are two ways to draw something that has an area of eight. Make sure that on your screen, you have both examples of a rectangle that has an area of eight. <laughs> 